Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can transfer data from an iPhone over to your Samsung Galaxy S22 series using a lightning cable and a USB cable. So what you need to do is to have either this cable here, so you've got lightning to USB-C, and if you have an older lightning cables, where it is lightning to USB-A, then you need to have this smart switch adapter. All right, so if you don't have this smart switch adapter, you can also try to get one of this cable on your iPhone. And before we begin, make sure you unlock your iPhone. And then on your Android phone, tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. Then swipe down at the top and tap on the settings icon. Next, you want to go down and tap on accounts and backup. Then go down and tap on bring data from old device. Next, we're going to plug in the cables. So USB-C to Android. Sorry. And then over here on the iPhone, we're going to plug in to the iPhone. Now again, make sure your phone is unlocked. All right, you can see on my Android device, it's saying um, check the iPhone. So on the iPhone, I'm going to tap on the trust button and I need to put in the passcode. All right, once we put in the passcode on your Android phone, tap on the next button and it's saying connecting and trying to search for data on the iPhone. Depending on how much data you have on your iPhone, it may be quick or it may take a while. And in the list here, it will tell you what will be transferred over from the iPhone to the Android. Uh, by default, the phone selected everything. Now you can uncheck that and that will deselect all of the items in here. And then you can go down the list here and choose what you want to transfer over to your Android. And here we've got um, calls and contacts, messages, apps. You can tap on it to view more information. It's the Android version of your iOS apps. Will be downloaded and you will get a recommended apps when there's no exact uh, match. And then you've got uh, data from iPhone apps. So you can transfer the data over, such as calendar, notes, bookmarks, and clock, and other things, depending on what you have installed on your iPhone. Then you can also get settings over, such as Wi-Fi password, Bluetooth information, and phone settings. So let's say the Wi-Fi information um, that you have used on the iPhone to connect to your Wi-Fi wi router, that information can also be transferred to your Android. And down here we've got images. You can tap on images and select which image you want to transfer over, videos, audios, and documents. Now I'm going to deselect some of the items because um, to transfer them all of them over can take quite a, lot, a long time. So in this uh, demo videos, I'm just going to select a few items here and then tap on the transfer button. And then it will begin. It's a backing up David's iPhone data. So it's going to back up the, font, uh, the data from the iPhones and then it will try to uh, begin transferring over to my Android device. Now you can also tap on keep screen on so that the screen doesn't uh, switch off during the transfer. Also it is best if you uh, can try to uh, try to charge up your device to a maximum 100% on both devices so that uh, during the transfer process um, it doesn't um, shut down. And that's it. So at the moment so here I have to wait for 30 minutes uh, before the transfer is complete. So again if you can have a lot of images and videos and your phone is like you know if you have a huge amount of data 128 gigabyte or 512 gigabytes that can take a long time to transfer over so just be patient uh, during the transfer process okay once it has finished you will see it say data transfer results and it tells you how many items has been transferred from the iphone over to your device and it will show you things like messages, calls and contacts, documents. You can tap also, you also can tap on the view more button to view more information. And then tap on next, and then tap on next to finish. Tap on next again, then tap on done. And that's it. So that is how you can bring 
or transfer the data from an iPhone over to your Android after you have set up the device and with using the USB cable. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.